I'm David Stark and welcome to the East Bay Real Estate Weather Report. As the holiday season approaches, it's no surprise that real estate activity slows down. But even with this change in the real estate seasons, the fact that we've had months of declining inventory and rising sales prices mean that in some communities, homes are on the market even longer compared to this time last year. Let's see if this is happening along the 880 corridor. Single family homes are on the market an average of 24 days in October 2016, a two day increase from last year. Inventory was virtually unchanged. Sales down 4% and sales prices up 11%. Moving into West Contra Costa County, things get interesting. Check this out. Inventory was up 21%, but sales were down 2%. And days on market increased by 50%. 10% increase in sales prices in this area could be driving these conditions. Next door in Central Contra Costa County, put a home on the market and it sells. A 13% increase in inventory corresponded with a 14% bump in sales activity. Days on market dropped from 36 to 26 days and sales prices came in 6% higher than during October 2015. Let's check out La Mirinda. Big jump in inventory, up 48%, but sales dropped 13% while days on market were virtually unchanged, just a 1% increase in sales prices. In the Tri-Valley, market conditions continue to mellow. There was a 9% increase in inventory, but sales were only up 7%. Days on market were almost unchanged, hovering in the 37-day range for most communities. Sales prices only up 2%. Finally, let's go to the Delta. Inventory down 10%, sales down 10%, and days on market down slightly from 30 to 28 days, but prices up 12%. That's it for this month's East Bay Real Estate Weather Report. If you need more information about East Bay real estate markets, visit the Bay East website at www.bayeast.org. Click on the Community Info tab. Use the map to select your community. Then click on the Housing Market Information button. We'll see you next month.